This weekend, Team Live Plantier, which is an international pro cycling team, one of the top 10 female teams in the world, has sent four of their riders to South Africa. Hey, I'm Chiara Steins. Hi, I'm Claudia Mackay. My name is Sabrina Soltis. Hi, yeah, my name is uh, Julia Souk. Yeah, we arrived uh, Friday night here in South Africa after a long travel of almost 24 hours. Yeah. We had yeah, a really warm welcome from the whole uh, Plum 2 crew. I really liked it. But they arrived here to a great welcome from the team, from the Plantier South African team. Um, they have no, they had no idea what to expect. They arrived here searing heat in mid thirties. Uh, they just come from icy Holland, where it is really freezing. Twitter ride is basically a ride which happens before most major races. So that's what's happened today. Um, there's about a few thousand riders here, I would say, a couple of thousand, and uh, our, our, our team has joined them. And they're just going to go on a social ride for about 40 k's, end up at an expo. My Twitter ride was actually really nice. I didn't expect, expect so much people, and it was nice to see that there are so many people on the bike here in Africa. We're, the team is giving back a little. We've identified a development organization called Velokaya. We're actually fostering or forging relationships with uh, organizations or rather teams that are based overseas, which is something that we at Velokaya cannot give the riders because we, technically speaking, are limited to actually just showing, showcasing their talent nationally. But I mean, if they can get that um, international uh, exposure, then that it, it is a great thing for Velokaya. We've identified a female development rider called Zanele Choco um, and we're donating 20,000 Rand to her. Um, in fact, the team and Plantier is donating 20,000 Rand to her to help with her development. Uh, it means a lot to me because to get the support from the Planto uh, team, my dream is to one day be part of the European team so I can be one of the girls also. I'm feeling good, so we will see. It's really early in the morning now, <laughs> but yeah, almost there. The girls, um, they are ready as well. Um, yeah, we're going to do our best. And see what we can do today. Yeah, it's really important to uh, stay with the four together, talk to each other how it's going, and uh, yeah, how the race is uh, going. Three, two, one. The race was, uh, I think, warm, <laughs> yeah, but it was great. It was uh, nice to go through uh, Joburg. Uh, some tough climbs in the, in the race. Uh, Ashley Bowman pulled there in Joburg. There was a steep climb. She, she pulled the, the peloton already uh, apart. Uh, there was a front group of four girls. Sabrina was in, but they got put back again. And then until the final, uh, yeah, Ashley went again alone. That was the moment. Um, but uh, in the end, Sabrina was really strong. Flunky McKay, second, Sabrina Sulkin, and our overall winner, Ashley Bowman Fossil. Mm, yeah, it was a really hard race, also with the heat, and yeah, we. In Holland, it's not so warm on the moment, and we start training again for a few weeks, so that was already a hard time. And uh, yeah, at the first climb, there was a breakaway, and Sabrina was in, and I told you they get away, but we came back all together, and then, uh, yeah, on the GPM climb, Ashley was too strong for us all, and then, uh, yeah, we could finish it good, second and third. It's really nice to be here and everyone is so kind and friendly and um, yesterday during the Twitter ride I had also a bit of problems with the heat and uh, the attitude so um, yeah I was a bit scared about it uh, today and um, yeah we started very early so it wasn't uh, so hot 
but um, yeah, still a bit of problems with the attitude, but yeah, it's really nice that we came uh, second and third. Today they were a bit tired uh, still from the training from, uh, from the, the race from yesterday. Um, but we wanted to do some hours, good weather, and uh, yeah, the, now we are here. We want to ride our bike as much as possible. Um, so it was, it was an endurance ride and not too hard, no, no, train, no block training, uh, just doing the hours. Um, it was good like this. Uh, my favorite African experience for so far, yeah. The peoples are so nice and so friendly to everybody, but I hope that I can see really nice animals this week, because I really love animals, so. Yeah, really an, an unforgettable moment uh, to see the baby lions. Uh, it was really nice. That was the really biggest highlight. We were cuddling with small lions, and that was yeah, that was cute. Actually, the whole experience was, I didn't expect it like this. I, I'm really happy that, uh, that we could be here and yeah, I definitely come back because uh, I'm not finished. <laughs> I'm not finished yet, so uh, I, I definitely come back to see more and uh, for me, uh, yeah, I, yeah, the people, uh, that the people were so nice and helpful all the time and that uh, they made our stay uh, yeah, as nice as possible for us. Thank you. 